guys, so we're currently on our way to, well, Brittany has medication to pick up, and then I have to return these dang earbuds, unfortunately, because, earbuds, yeah, well, case. we ordered earbuds, so we ordered this new phone, uh, so I ordered a Note 20 Ultra, and then Brittany ordered the regular Note 20, and then we both got, like, nice Galaxy Active Watches, and then we both ordered the Galaxy Buds Pro, um, except mine came and they were brand new and hers came and there were no earbuds in the case. So I've been kind of going back and forth with this dude on eBay to figure out where the hell the earbuds is because they was listed with the earbuds. It was like listed as open box. And the thing is with the earbuds, you actually can't use them if you don't have the case to connect to your phone and everything anyway. So I like, it was just very confusing f for me. So I text the guy back and I was like, yo, where are the earbuds? I bought the earbuds. And I checked the listing to make sure that I didn't just order one of the listings that was just for the case. And they're like, it, it was all on his end and I messaged him and everything. And now we actually got to take them back. And I ordered a new set for her, but it's just a frustrating process. So we're on our way walking to the ship on site place and CVS and all. Um, and this is just, this Roxboro, huh. you know? We just we just hanging out. It's nice. It's warm out. Um, that's about it. Let me know what you guys think of the quality. Um, we're gonna continue walking. Obviously, it's probably like a good two miles both ways, like two miles that way and then two miles Maybe. back, something like that. But we've been trying to walk more either way, so it's not that big of a deal. But I'll return this, and hopefully the new earbuds actually come with the earbuds in the case and not just the case so we are actually back home now i we stopped at the thrift shop when we were out uh, and we we were so I, I actually i don't know if i said it on social media just not on youtube but i turned in the orders for the new free space shirts and everything um but we wanted to there were a few additions i made where we wanted to get a little because britney's sister caitlin actually had a kid in december and we want to get a little like, cause uh, Caitlin ordered a long sleeve and Dalton, her boyfriend ordered a t-shirt and we want to get uh, Addison, it's her name, uh, like a little onesie type thing with the free space logo on it. So we actually ended up finding a little white onesie for her that we're going to take up there before we collect the orders and see if they can print the logo on there as well. Um, so we could, I, I just, we thought it would be like a little cute idea and all. But we went to the thrift shop, we went to CVS, I dropped off the dang earbuds. Um, and so hopefully the dude refunds me my money because it, it's just a frustrating kind of situation to be in and all. But gosh, I think I think the picture looks really good on it. Like it, it, it clearly doesn't have like the bokeh and everything. Like the background, it, it, you can see a little bit of separation between me and the background. It's clearly not as blurred as my camera would be. But I also could just turn the phone around because the back cameras have a bit of blur because they're f1.8. The wide angle lens is f2.2 and then the zoom lens is f1.8 I believe or the normal lens and then the zoom lens is I, I don't know. Um, but the, the strange thing is so the Note it has the pro video mode but it's weird because you can't use the pro video mode. Oh I guess uh breaker must have blew. actually ended up blowing the breaker I'm currently making. Um, we have wing night usually like once a week um, and my mom gets a bunch of these breaded boneless wings and I cook them in the air fryer because they turn out really crispy. It's almost like you actually go to like a like a buffalo wild wings or something to eat them. But it's weird because the phone has a pro video mode where you can adjust all the settings and everything manually like I would with my camera. Like the shutter speed and the ISO, but the strange thing is you can't actually adjust your f-stop. Isn't that weird? Like if it's f1.8, why can't it be adjusted? Like I don't know if that's a saving space constraint, but the the freaking camera thing already like leans off the back like that much, so you know just make it a little bit bigger so I can adjust the dang aperture. But th th I guess that's not that big of a deal. It takes nice pictures and everything. Um, and then it's weird as well because you can't use the front camera with it. And then another thing that's kind of like strange is, so when you take pictures with this front camera here, it usually has a little button that pops up and it allows you to like make it a little bit wider. And you actually don't have that in the video either, which I'm kind of confused about. 
Um, I mean, it's already pretty wide. Like, this is wider than my camera would be, or, or it allows me to stretch my arm out more. And the stabilization is nice. It's kind of, like, strange at times. Like, when you see the background warping or something, you know, like, it starts to warp, but that's just something with the phone because it's, it's digitally stabilized. There's no way for it to be optically stabilized because it's in the phone and everything. But it, it's just crazy to think about how good phone your phone camera is. And when I was kind of making my decision to kind of go back with just filming on my phone for my YouTube channel, a lot of it had to, like, I thought about a lot of the videos I shot. And some of my favorite videos to go back and watch were on my phone. And that's not to say I don't have a lot of videos I love that were taken on like an actual camera because a lot of the videos I love were taken on my YI camera, which I really do love, but I've complicated it so much and I don't want to be walking around Walmart with my dang like full size camera. And I use my full size camera for video work and things and I don't really want to break it, you know, to, and my phone's waterproof and it can pretty much be taken anywhere. You know, I always have it in my pocket and it's just, it, it's like, it's nice video quality. It's not like... I don't really see any downsides quite to it. So I think I'm just going to go back to filming on my phone for my YouTube and actually get the content up because I'd like to get to a point where I don't necessarily have to make videos for other people where I can just focus on making videos for myself. And that's something I've always wanted, but it was something I never could like stay consistent enough with to do. So I'd like to just start daily vlogging with my phone. It doesn't have to be anything spectacular. I've always kind of held myself to the standard that Casey holds himself to. And I just, I got to realize that like, that's not really for me, you know? It's kind of with my streams. Like there's people that are super good at video games. Like my friend Matt is amazing at Call of Duty. And unfortunately, I'm just not one of those people, you know? Like I'm not super great at Call of Duty or anything. And most people that come by to watch my streams don't really come by for gameplay and stuff like they'll joke and be like this game sucks yada yada things like that or and joke around with me but I feel like a lot of people come more so for my personality than the super blurry background or you know just things like that I feel like I put too much emphasis on those things a lot of time um, but I just want to get back to vlogging I want to get back to creating I'd like to get back to gaming on YouTube um, I'm about to buy Resident Evil 8 and do a walkthrough on that and Brittany's hopefully going to do that too if any of you guys have been around for a while you remember I made her stuff play Resident Evil 7 but unfortunately I never had a return to it but we're gonna get her playing Resident Evil 8 whether it be on stream or for YouTube or anything but I'd just like to start doing gameplays again I'd like to start vlogging again and the only thing with it I'm having kind of a hard time deciding between is if I'm going to use the same account for everything or if I should go back because I still have my EXO Plays account and my Will's Life account and I'm trying to decide if I should like just upload my vlogs to here, upload my gaming to here, um, should I upload them all together to here or should I separate them? I feel like I should separate them for the gameplay because I'll be spamming a bunch of videos up but then again I, I don't really know. I feel like I should use my EXO Plays account for the gaming and then use this account for the vlogging, that would kind of make more sense to me. But, I mean, we've been out walking and stuff enough. Even if it's not really, like, vlogging my day, at least I could talk and speak and everything and just have an overall good time. So, um, if you guys like the camera quality or you think it's fine or even if you don't think it's fine, if you don't like it, let me know what you don't like about it. If there's anything that I could kind of fix with it or if there's any specific topics you'd like to hear me cover, then let me know. If there's any games you'd like to see me play, I'd love to hear your suggestions on games that you'd like to see walkthroughs or just to see me play in general. Because um, I, I I feel like a lot of, I'm not the typical per like people come to watch me for the freaking, like the humor, you know, for my personality. At least I think that's what it is. It's not really my good looks. Um, it's not really my gameplay or my game because I'm not, I'm not really that great at games. I had to mute myself in Discord. I just feel like that's weird. Like I'm having a hard time adjusting back to talking to the camera. Um, so I, I felt weird walking down the street with it. But I, I just got to get over that. It's so weird to me. Because I, I there's a quote that I like to bring up. And my, that's my, If you hear the noise, it's the air conditioner. Um, so this will be a good test of the mic quality on here. But they said, don't be mad for the credit you don't receive for the work you didn't put in. So I can't be mad at people, dude. So my dang dog was barking as usual, but um, 
yeah, I just, I can't, I can't be mad that I'm not able to make a living off my YouTube or something when I'm not putting forth the full effort I can, you know? I, if I want to make videos for myself, then I need to actually start making videos for myself. And the first step of doing that is simplifying the process as much as possible so I actually pick up the camera and vlog. That, that, that's all there is to it. I have to do it. I can't like sit here and complain about it and then just choose not to do it. I got to do it. So let me know if you like the video quality. Let me know what you'd like to see me talk about or go do. You know, I, I'm thinking about going like rafting sometime soon, you know, bringing the GoPro and everything. Um, let me know what you'd like to see me play. I want to start off with Resident Evil 8, more than likely. Um, we actually started the Bitcoin mining on the computers and all, and we're doing pretty well. Like, right now, I started yesterday at um, around 10 o'clock, and I'm currently at $10.60, which isn't a lot in the grand scheme of things, but, you know, you multiply $10 by freaking 30 days in a month, and, like, my goal this month is to pay my dang car payment with it. I think that would be so freaking sweet to just be able to pay my car payment off something that's just running on my computer 24-7 when I'm not streaming or editing videos or don't, like, not playing games or something. Like, I just think that's so dope to have that kind of passive income. And that's something I'm really trying to focus on, um, is a lot more with the passive income and stuff like that, so, uh, but that's about it. Um... I should hopefully be making more videos, I don't want to jinx anything. Um, I should be uploading again to YouTube gaming videos. Let me know what you think, I, th I think I should use my Exodius Plays account for my gaming videos and just tag them on this YouTube channel and then use this YouTube channel for my vlog because it's kind of became more of like my real life and everything. So, Thank you guys for hanging out, I appreciate it. Um, and if you'd like, come by the stream tonight, twitch.tv slash Exodius Live. No matter where life takes me, find me with